Hello YouTube, welcome to today's tutorial. Uh, today is the first, well, the first proper programming tutorial in this series of uh, the gambling game. And what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to go through the variables and the methods that we are going to be using. So first of all, what we must, we, what we need to import is a scanner, uh, and just call it scan, and say that's equal to new scanner, and in the parameters say system dot in. Okay, and then just go ahead, uh, hover your mouse over there and say import scanner, and that's uh, the first thing. Then what we need to do is we need to declare a static string called name for the user to input their name. Then we need a static string um, for uh, the menu. So let's just make a array of it, and we say menu is equal to. Um, uh, one is start game and then two is say help okay um, why is that giving me an error okay I need to put double quotation marks And okay, so I'm done that. Then what I'm going to need is I'm going to need a static integer uh, for th how much money they have. I'm going to need a static integer for um, the bet op uh, option they choose. Okay. Um, then I'm going to need another static integer for the how much money they bet. Um, and then I'm going to use another. Um, well, I'm going to use another integer uh, called pot, but that's going to be a private integer or local integer at a later stage um, that I'll do it just so you know um, that I'm going to use it as well. So those are all my variables that I'm going to be using. The methods I'm going to be using is my main method. Um, I'm going to need to display. Well, I'm going to need a method. Um, public static void display okay uh, so that's just gonna say hello to the user and then I'm going to need a method called um, start game so again public static void start game okay and then um, I'm going to need another method called money uh, so public static void money um, public static void bet option so that's how uh, what they're going to bet on uh, I'm just going to minimize these here quick because we're not going to use them straight away then we're going to have a method um, called user bet uh, so public static void user bet and then we're gonna have one more method called help okay so those are all the methods we're gonna be using and then in the next tutorial I will be showing you I'll be going through the beginning uh, programming stages of this so thank you very much look forward to seeing you in the next tutorial